Over the next two weeks on Days of Our Lives, Chad Dimira pays a visit to Lucas Horton in prison. Lucas, serving time for the abduction of his ex, Sami Brady, may receive some intriguing news during Chad's visit. Fans are left wondering if this visit signals Lucas's release from Statesville Prison. During this meeting, will Chad take the opportunity to discuss his plans to marry Stephanie Johnson, whom he has been dating for quite some time? Stephanie's affection for Chad's two children might put pressure on Lucas's friend to take the plunge, especially with Stephanie's mother encouraging the union. Lucas Gordon also needs to catch up on the latest happenings in Salem. What will Chad share with his friend about recent events, including the unexpected twist involving Victor Kyriakis's will? The two may delve into the ongoing drama at the Dimir mansion as well. The discussion will undoubtedly touch upon Lucas Horton's mother, Kate Roberts, who Chad regards as a second mother. Chad's visit to Statesville Prison promises intriguing interactions and the question of whether Lucas will be pleased to see him. In the world of days of our lives, Ava Vitali faces potential repercussions for her involvement in rescuing Susan Banks. Ava followed her instincts and pursued Susan's clues to London with the assistance of her new partner, Harris Michaels. Unexpectedly, Susan Banks has a change of heart regarding the kidnapping charges against Ava. However, the individuals responsible for taking Susan to England may now have their sights set on Ava Vidali, who has sinister intentions for E.J. Dimira's mother and Ava. Harris Michaels, without a doubt, will do his utmost to protect his new love interest. Yet, the identity of this looming threat to Ava remains a mystery. This development may kickstart the latest enigma on Days of Our Lives, leaving viewers to search for clues about the individual or group targeting Susan and Ava in the weeks to come.